welcome to another episode of Wild Game and Open Flame. We're uh, out bow hunting today in uh, northern New South Wales and um, we are chasing a few different kind of game, basically whatever walks in front. So pigs, goats, um, if we get a wild dog that makes things pretty cool. Um, but yeah, so we're out here, it's very cold and very early in the morning. Um, so we're just going to basically follow this river very quietly and um, see what pops up. So. See how we go. Let's do it. All right, day two. Um, Basically, it's going to be an interesting day. Um, Kane's gone one way, Brand's gone the other. Jesse's going to go and do some filming, just some nature stuff, and um, I'm going to head up um, along the river a different way. So the wind's swirling. Before it was going this way, now it's doing that. Um, so you just yeah, you never know with this kind of area, uh, especially with these mountains. So um, I'm going to get just walk along this river and see what happens. See the wind's just changed again, straight in my face. All right, see so how we go. Yeah, no girl. Off you go. Not interested in you. Go breed again. You're all right. You're all right, girl. I'm sorry. Guys, we've had success, thank God. It's been a, it's been a hard day today. Um, slept in a little bit. We all went our different directions and we uh, had success. Brandon finally got a, a goat. We saw two goats yesterday. We got footage of them. Um, Brandon was taking his nice time. He was flicking lures. He was having a nice time. Kane came from the other direction and so did Jesse. And so we've all seen goats today except for me. Um, I went the opposite direction, so um, we had success. Awesome, very, very happy. We're going to do a quick lunch because Brandon's going home, so we want to, we want to try the goat with him. Um, I didn't come very prepared for anything other than what I had planned for meals, so I'm just using what I've got in my pantry. Um, Brandon said the stalk was between 10 to 15 to 20 metres, uh, so a nice ethical shot. Basically, we've seen the footage, it was the goat had passed away. Little Billy, only a young one, uh, was basically passed away within seconds. It was beautiful, a beautiful ethical shot, so it's great stuff. Um, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to butterfly this little goat leg and we're going to put it on the uh, barbecue. We're going to put a bit of passion fruit jam with it and an onion, okay? So, like I said, we're just using what we've got. Um, very excited, we're very happy. We're uh, having beers. Uh, for celebration, so um, here's to Brandon's um, success.
All right, so like I said, we're only using the ingredients we've got. We didn't pack for, for much because we had basically meals planned. So I didn't even pack oil. But a good little substitute is actually beer or butter. Okay, so this is gonna be very quick because the goat's basically room temperature. Brandon only shot it about an hour and a half ago. He butchered it while we're, all of us were all out chasing our own animals. So a little bit of a... Uh, It's going to be quite dark because of the uh, sugar in the jam and that's okay. We just keep the uh, moisture up to it and cook it probably, I'd say, the amount of heat coming off it, it's only going to be about four minutes each side and uh, we'll get into some nice sandwiches. go guys um, it is seriously tender it's wow yeah it's basically lamb it's it's nice young Billy um, look how tender and juicy it is very simple took what four five minutes each side very easy so I'll quickly make a passion fruit um, goat and onion sanger all right come with me and I'll show you There we go guys, simple, easy dish. Here you go mate, for the one who did the, the hard work. Thank you. All right guys, cheers. Uh, thanks for watching the episode, um, cheers. All right, thanks for watching this episode guys, really appreciate it, make sure you like and subscribe. Before you go, um, we've got a few episodes uh, in the works, we've basically filmed and uh, editing, but sadly uh, we lost a close friend uh, recently uh, to the channel so um, we're gonna just just for respect to the family we're just basically gonna wait uh, until it's okay for them to put this out so uh, this video will come out before all their videos um, we're in a, having a, a great little bow hunting weekend this week um, you know it's it's fantastic to get out in nature and I really recommend it so um, very sad time for us uh, uh, for Jesse and I we've, uh, we've lost a very close mate so um, you know, we'll, we'll keep pushing on um, because I know that's what he wanted. So, um, yeah, we've got a couple episodes in the loops. Make sure you'll be keen to see them. But like I said, respectfully, we're just waiting for them. Thanks, guys. See you next one.